Yo, it's me, Chris, and today I am wearing the shit shirt. Ooh. Ooh, look yeah. at that. Damn. Feeling good as usual. I'm with this guy. Ah! It's Halloween. Get scared. It's me, Curtis, a.k.a. King of Spears, a.k.a. Built Different, a.k.a. Chubby Rain, himself in the flesh. I am here. We're here. Hi. And we come bearing great and sad news. The sad news is, is that October is pretty much over. This was the last horror movie poll for this month. I am devastated. My day is ruined. Possibly my life. But that's okay. There's always next October to look forward to. I just really love the genre of horror. We'll do more here and there, of course, but we're going to focus on more diversity of films in the upcoming months. November, we might even start off with a bang and do our first animated film. Ooh. Mm. So look forward to that November 2nd. But um, we also just want to say thank you guys for subscribing. Honestly, there's a lot of you out there that have been like supportive as hell and generally just being incredibly nice people. Even the people who personally DM me are generally incredibly nice. I've had very, very, very rare negative interaction. I think I can even count them on my fingers, on one hand. So that's impressive in itself. So again, I just love you guys. So thank you for subscribing. And if you don't subscribe, all right, I ain't going to force you. You know, it's your life, dude. You do what you want. Just subscribe, goddammit, okay? All right, he's not going to force you, but I'm going to fucking force you. All right, you're going to subscribe. You're going to hit the bell. You're going to do whatever the fuck I say. You got it? All right, there, the, the banana spoke. Every time you don't subscribe, you see this banana? It gets flaccid. Nobody likes a flaccid banana, I'll tell you that much. No, I do not. Oh, so subscribe. <laughs> it's <a stupid> <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. How the fuck I'm doing, dude? Yeah, I'm also going to shout out the Patreon because of the Patreon. Woo! Oh, my God. Patreon, baby. <laughs> uh, we exclusively are doing uh, reactions to Squid Game on there. We have a couple episodes up there right now. I'm really enjoying the show, so if you want to check that out. Show. Wow. So if you want to check that out, you can check that out too. We got that going on there. Uh, but yeah, that's about all our shilling we can do right now. Yeah, I think there's not much more of the shill. No, I've got the, nothing else. The movie we're watching is Poltergeist, okay? Poltergeist won by a landslide on the Patreon poll. I'm really excited. I've wanted to watch this for a long time. And we're just going to slither right into it. Whoa. Yo, show him a slither, Curtis. Give him the slither. Is that good? You look like you're being electrocuted. How the fuck was that a slither? Wasn't that a slither? No. Oh, that's what, I thought that's what snakes look like when they're slithering on the ground. Maybe what kind of fucking snakes are you looking at? Uh, I don't know. Oh shit, we're Canadian. Doesn't matter. Oh, yeah. Well, shit. Well, we are polite Canadians. Poltergeist. Who are not polite. Nope. They're mean. Is Let's that the White House? Me. I think so, yeah. I could see it with the little columns there. Probably. Who's this close to the TV? Holy shit. Right? Holy shit. What's he doing? I don't know. Oh, man, he has to go out. <gasps> no! Ooh. He's getting chips! But, wait, he's left the chips. Oh, no, he got no, chips. No, he's getting them. Look at that. He's a smart boy. Good boy. Eat the chips. All right. We had some breakfast. Where are we going now? Yeah, what do they have in this room? Kid's lucky not to have epilepsy. I'll tell you that much. My oh, God. 100%, man. You'd be falling down that stairs, dude. Jesus. Yeah, this is giving me ring vibes. <laughs> Holy shit. Right? Just standing so close to the... Why is she talking to the TV? Five. That is fucking freaky, dude. The kids talking in the cells freak me out. Well, apparently she wasn't talking to herself. When it looks like they're talking to themselves. Steven Spielberg! Oh shit, really? Yo, this is definitely gonna be good now. That's all I need to see. Wow, that's actually beautiful with the hills in the back like that. It looks like a very lovely place to live. This guy is looking really happy on his bike. He's having a good day. Well, his hairline's not though. Oh, God. Oh, no. No. Wait. 
No! No! Oh my god! His beers! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> He's just spraying everywhere. <laughs> Dude, look at that shit! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> he has a sprinkler in the fucking room! Oh my god, dude, I love it. Look at that! <laughs> oh, of course. Star Wars bed sheets? That is fucking cool. Nice. Oh, is it called Tweety, really? Oh. No! Shit, Tweety, couldn't you have waited for school day? What? <laughs> Show some respect for Tweety. What the fuck? <laughs> Mr. Rogers. Who the hell is this guy? <laughs> what? Wait, she's just what? If he comes back to life before. Oh no! Oh, Why would you flush the bird? My god. There are far better ways to dispose of it. Maybe just be honest and have a burial for it? Like, don't that's... fucking flush it! Oh my god. Oh, that's annoying. Oh, he's climbing the Whomping Willow. Look at that. Get him out of here. Just like launches him across the fucking city. Yes, that's better. Yes. Yeah. You get a nice fucking pretty flower for Tweety now. Maybe right? put a Twizzler in there as well. Give him a uh, give Tweety a snack for the great beyond. That's what I'm talking about. There we go, man. I like this kid. One nice. for the road. And a picture too. Oh, that's sweet. Beautiful. What a wonderful child. Honestly. Adios, Tweety. Moment of silence for Tweety. Can I have a goldfish now? Oh my god, fucking kids. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh jeez. Grieving's over. She got the goldfish. Why the fuck is there some kind of creepy ass clown doll sitting at the edge of the bed? For real. Does it have his own chair? Yeah, he has his own chair. What the fuck? Oh, an alien poster? Yo, these kids are fucking dope, dude. They're cool, dude. Alien's the best. Yeah, why the fuck is that there? Why would you keep this thing in your room? Is he gonna shoot him? Oh. Okay. Okay. He shot the clown. Is he dead? I think so. Oh, Chewbacca. A Chewbacca coat? Nice. So it's clear that he's scared of this clown. Why do they have it in the room then if he's fucking afraid of it? I don't know. I don't get it. <laughs> Is this guy okay? No, no. <laughs> Is he doing Donald Duck? Yeah, he's doing Donald Duck. <laughs> <laughs> he just walked into a fucking circus, dude. Nice, being carried back. That's a uh, premium service. Cool. Huh. That was a good way to help this kid. No, Dana. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Is the ghost or poltergeist a patriot? Maybe. They're very I, patriotic. They like this music. Uh oh. Uh oh. Fuzzy TVs are never good. Oh, kid, please don't talk to the TV again. What? Whoa, fuck! What the f- 
fuck is this? That's a big spooky hand. Huh? Holy fuck. Wait. Did the poltergeist kind of like go into the house? Here. Oh shit, that's where that's from. Wow. Oh wow. That's been like uh That's referenced a lot. They're here. But now is it like so the uh the poltergeist left the TV and now is it No, was that Tweety? Dude, what's with the disrespect for the bird? Yo, there's nothing on the radio. Yeah. 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 Yo! Yo, Waffle! Alright, we're having fun. Nice. Yo, that guy's mustache! What the fuck? Hey, man, don't worry about it. It's called style. Hey! It's not my mess! <gasps> Shit. How the fuck does that happen? Grip strength. Oh shit! His fork is <laughs> fucked! Oh my god. No. Not the spoon, too! Dude, these guys are fucking creepy. Aren't they? Isn't she way too young? Yeah, definitely. Oh, it's fucking weird, man. Ugh. Oh, honey, you're gonna ruin your eyes. This is not good for you. <laughs> She puts out a warp! Oh, shit! <laughs> that's so ironic, dude. Oh, that's great. I love that. <laughs> Fucking disgusting! Oh, my God. That's gross. What the fuck? Oh... Oh, I should have knocked him the hell out for doing that. You want to see mommy lying in a cigar box covered with licorice? <laughs> That's freaky, dude. That really is. Oh, shit. The garbage bin's inside, too, now. We're waiting. Oh. She's so hyped. She's really excited about this. He's looking for like wheels. Well, no, like string or anything. Yep. Wow. going in the kitchen till I know what's happening. That's fair, honestly. Honestly, yeah. If I'm sliding around my kitchen like that, hell no. Yo, man, poor kid, dude. He's scared of the clown. He's scared of the fucking tree, dude. And they're, like, blocking both sides of him. One's in front, the other one's on the side. He can't escape them. Nah, he's trapped. <laughs> Holy shit! What the fuck?! Dude, and the clown's in her bed. Oh, I was saying, let's go play. Oh, that's fucking freaky, dude. Yeah. There's a tornado? What, is there like a fucking vacuum in there? What the? Oh my god! She's flying! What? Oh, bye, clown! <laughs> See ya, clown! Oh, that's actually a positive. Wait, the tree's eating him? What in the fuck? Okay, now that's just like. That's. Oh my god! Bye! Holy shit! 
What, in the vents? No fucking way! Dude, it's clearing the whole room out! Dude, the goldfish are fucked. Oh my god, no way! Dude, he's like, if I'm going out, you're coming with me. No, he's gone! Yo, what the hell is going on? Did they like suck her inside of the, like, the wall or? That's gonna be the clown, right? Fucking clown. <laughs> so did she get like sucked into the wall? I don't know. Maybe she's in the TV. The TV? The TV people. That's so fucking weird. Is it like another dimension or like another world? What the fuck? How do you explain this one to people? Oh, lost my ta daughter. She's in the TV. We keep the room locked uh, off in the rest of the house, so. How many disturbances have you recorded in the room? We don't go in the room anymore. Okay. That's scary. I mean, you can't blame them, right? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Riding a horse? Duh, I, I, I like how the clown's just like riding around on the mattresses. Yeah, <laughs> look at her. We hear better on this channel. Don't ask me why. Man, that lady's thinking I'm not qualified for this shit. <laughs> yeah, she's like, ah. she's second guessing her career choice. <laughs> Jesus. He's looking worse and worse as the seconds go by. Yeah, that must be so traumatizing for the child. Oh, yeah. What Excuse me? Fuck? Huh? Jewelry? What about that hole in her wall? Oh, yeah. Could that lead into it? Is it like the dimension portal? I don't fucking under... I... Ghost <laughs> smells! <laughs> What's going on? I don't know. I don't want to smell the fucking clothes. What's happening? <laughs> Whoa! Holy shit! You just launched everyone on the floor. I can't hear her anymore. Caroline, honey. Dude, that was yeah, powerful. She's got the right idea. Get the fuck away from the TV. Let's go up there. They won't let you in. We'll just see about that. Woo! Fuck you, poltergeist. Something took a bite out of me. Holy oh. shit. So it bit him? Look, what the fuck took a chunk out of him like that? That is nasty. It's a big bite. That's not even like human or anything like that. My man. Getting his crunch on. Oh, I'm gonna go get something to eat. Okay. You just ate. You want something more than chips, dude. Chips are a snack, not a meal. Oh, he's taking the Ritz crackers. Is this just like eating from everything? What the fuck? He's literally making himself at home. Holy shit. He's taking a whole steak? Oh! 
Oh, that's weird. Cool. The stake is alive. Oh, it's moving like a snail. What in the fuck? Excuse me? Oh, oh shit. that is fucking disgusting. Whoa, okay, no fucking way. Oh, holy shit! Whoa! Dude, that was fucking cool. Dude, get the fuck out of here. Oh my god. What the fuck is that light? Uh, hello? Who's here? Oh shit. Oh, is that the... Okay. Dude, I would be waking everyone up. Like, come and see that. Oh, is that a person in there? I think so. No, I feel like Pops is gonna throw hands. Oh yeah, look at that. He's getting ready. Yo, let's go, Dad. Beat it up. Has our house become like a hub for ghosts? Maybe it's a house for ghosts now. Like, yo, check like, in. Come yeah, it's the ghost hotel. All ghosts are welcome. Dude, the father's looking shittier and shittier, man. Oh, my God. Dog, he's leaving. Bye, dog. Bye. Oh. Good dog. You have to go and uh, protect the little one. Yay, dog is safe. All of this can be your master bedroom suite. That can be your view. Oh. Oh, it's right next to a graveyard. How much room for pool is there? Oh my god. You're kidding. Oh, come on. I mean, that's sacrilegious, isn't it? Oh, don't worry. They about it. relocated the fucking cemetery? Besides, we've done it before. When? Oh my Seven. god. Oh my god, that explains it. So that's why there's poltergeists in their house. Oh, fuck. I just don't think that's a thing you do. You relocate a cemetery? You can't do that. That just sounds horrible. Why would you do that in any sense? What is she? A ghost whisperer? Maybe. Ghost specialist? Definitely not a ghost buster. Nope, not that. What side of the rainbow are we working? Come here, honey. And give me your hand. I'm not gonna bite you. You sure? Just rips it right off. Just nibbles on it. Now let's go get your daughter. Damn, okay. Alright, let's go. Holy shit. Whoa, it's like a rave in the fucking room, dude, in the closet. Are they gonna go in? I don't know what's up. Ew, what is all this shit? I'm always going in. Adios, mama. God, that bright flashlight's killing yeah, me. Yeah, I know, dude. Ah, <laughs> uh, no, mama's going in. All right, mama, let's go. What's in the afterlife? Or mid-part life? Is that purgatory, this? I don't even fucking know. I don't know. I'm just What's gonna... inside your house? I'm just going to call it Ghostland. Ghostland. Let's go to Ghostland. Whoa! 
Holy shit! Oh, ew, what is that? Oh, what the fuck is this shit? Yeah, why are they all slimy? Is the... Is the, is the ghost land slimy? Oh, looks like they're color, uh, covered in jam. Looks like strawberry jam. Holy shit. Is it really over? Did they cl how'd they clean it then? I just saw a big ass skeleton face come flying out of their fucking closet door. Where'd he go? Yeah, no surprise in the quick move. Yep. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, damn the bike. Well, oh, you know Teague, you won't take go to hell for an answer. What are you gonna tell him? I'm gonna give him directions. <laughs> oh my god! Dude, I love that. That's that was so, so good. good. <laughs> that was horrible. I swear, if this clown fucking... Okay. Alright. Stay in your lane, clown. What? Oh. Is that Luke? She's Why eating, are you... She's eating Luke! Yo, Yoda will protect him. That's Look right. at that. Yoda can fuck up a clown. Oh, fuck. Dude, that's every kid's worst fucking nightmare right there. Maybe that skull thing came out in a sense in like... Oh, and went into the clown? Oh, don't tell Mr. Clown's oh, gonna be there. Oh, is there a Mr. Clown under there? Oh. Oh, no, he's not. Whoa, there he is! Holy shit! What if it's Tweety getting revenge? Yeah, I don't think Tweety would be doing this kind of shit. Oh my god. Reminds you of Nightmare on Elm Street. I was about to say that! Holy shit! Yeah! yeah! Beat his ass! Oh no! He's tearing the clown apart! He's killing it! Fuck yeah, kid! Yeah! Get his ass! What in the fuck is What those? is that? Tentacles? Whoa! Holy shit! Oh, that's fucking sad, dude. She's desperate as hell. Oh no. Oh my gosh, she just took that bath and everything. Whoa! Holy shit! Oh my god, they're swarming her! Dude, it's like a pool party down there for corpses. Oh my god. Holy shit. <clears throat> oh shit. What the? What in the fuck is that? Wait, what? Yo, what is this thing?
Oh my god. Dude, there's like a fucking war going on in his house. Holy fuck, dude! Oh my god! So all the coffins are rising. Yeah, I just... Yeah, man, fuck the house, fuck the belongings, fuck everything. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh. What the fuck? Whoa, what the fuck is going on? So the house is eating itself. Yeah, it's kind of like imploding on itself. Wow, yeah. Holy shit, what a finale! Oh my god! <laughs> Just when I thought I've already seen the finale. Yeah! They hit you with that. <laughs> we, we'll miss you. They sure as hell won't miss you. Oh my god, they all look so miserable. Very miserable looking people. <laughs> yeah, they're gonna be afraid of televisions for a while. Holy for a shit. a long time, there will not be a TV in their home. Wow. Wow, okay. Holy shit, dude. So we've just finished watching Poltergeist. And, um... It was one hell of a movie. Yeah, they, I think they should have just called it Poltergeist, right? Well, I mean, there was one main Poltergeist. There was one big baddie. Yeah, poltergeist. you're telling me like the one baddie was doing all that shit. Yeah, dude, he was pissed off. Dude, I, I'm actually blown away because like the whole sequence of saving their daughter, I was like, okay, it's it's yeah, over. They <laughs> saved the daughter, and you're like, okay, that was the climax, yeah. it's right? Like, At the end, <laughs> yeah. No. Shit hits the fan twice as hard. When the yeah. bodies start, when the coffins and the bodies oh, are dude. on the ground, that's cool. That was so sick. It's oh just like, I, I, I like that so much. It kind of like averts your expectation where it's just like, okay, the climax has happened. It's just like, nah, dude, round two, let's fucking go and let's make it go wild as shit. Dude, the fucking clown. Yo, dude, oh, the kid man. was tearing him apart. I hate you. Fuck yeah, you. Ripping I love shreds. that. I was he's killing him. He's fucking destroying this damn clown, man. Holy shit. That's what I'm fucking man. talking about. Dude, clown got fucked, man. Rightfully so. No. Give him the hands. Yo, give him the hands and then yeah, rip off his. I love that, dude. That was a good part. I, I really enjoyed that. But like, yeah, dude, not even that, but like, the, the, the fucking closet door turning into some kind of... It was like some kind of fungal... No, it was like a mouth? Like a big fungal spore mouth it, monster it, it thing? It kind of reminded me like the, the coming out of the, the, the tongue that was like, like the sarlacc yeah, pit. Yeah, it reminded me exactly of the sarlacc pit. And it just like, the tongue was coming out too, and I was like, oh shit. No, they got out of there, but still, I was like... It was just like so much is happening at the actual... The, the real climax scene, right? So much is happening. The coolest thing was the coffins coming out. The, the, the bodies coming out of the water and the coffins yeah, popping dude, up out of the that, ground. That was so fucking sick. Th that was really cool. Uh, and there. the bodies are just launching out of dude, them. Dude, they're just flying everywhere. Like, what you, what you? Another example. What about the big skeleton monsters at, yeah, at the dude. door? It was like, get away, bitch. The ghost skeleton? Like, Whoa. Yeah, I was like, back off, bitch. This is my door. Get away from me. You know, it was like a uh, barking like a dog or something. It kind of sounded like a dog or some big animal thing. I don't know, dude. It was creepy. It was a creepy looking guy. That's for sure. Not just that, but even like the the, the fucking dad. I think his name was Steven. He gets the, he sees like this big ass fucking skeleton thing coming out of the closet. I was just like, dude, I would never go near a closet ever again after seeing that. No, I love the ending when he rolls oh, yeah. the TV out of the room. Like, <laughs> fuck no. <laughs> that was actually a really good touch. It was. Like, never gonna have a TV in their uh, their. Their household ever again after that incident. Nope. No chance in hell. Not even that. I was even surprised that the fucking house imploded. 
You know what? I am too. I, I didn't. He was like, okay, not to, okay. It's so like the house is like going to fucking shit, right? Everything's going bananas. And even in the street, you see like a fucking thing, the, the, the fucking like uh, uh, fire hydrants exploding. Fire hydrants flying out of the sky. You I think like a, a gas burst, line went. A gas shit. line exploded too. We're like, dude, how far does this like poltergeist go? Well, you saw the graveyard. It was big. That is, oh, that is true. The graveyard was pretty big. Mm -hmm. Why the fuck would you move the stones but not the fucking bodies? Like, how dumb are you, dude? Oh, oh my god. Of course, Chris. Too much work. It will cost too much money to do a good job. Oh my god, dude. Holy shit. Uh, that was just... Uh, that was amazing. Yeah, good, good luck getting people to buy homes in that area ever again. <laughs> All the neighbors saw the house implode. What dude, do you do now? His it's just fucking tanked. Everything. Ooh, bam, his business is tanking. Uh, Why would you move the cemetery? Leave the cemetery where it is and build away from it. Yeah, build away from Why it. Why not fucking do that? Yeah, you, well, just leave it as it is, and like, why would you even try to move it? What's the point? It's already there. It's already established itself as there. Touching touching the dead and dead bodies and stuff like that, moving and relocating them, that just sounds like a stupid fucking idea. It's too much work. Don't do it at all. Just leave it as is. You know? Oh, my God. But, hey, man, people are stupid. Yeah, I love the fact that the guy experienced... Um... His steak tearing itself apart. Okay. Maggots in his chicken. And then his face dude, fucking this, melting. Dude, the practical effects for his face just melting was fucking crazy. Like, yeah. it was genuinely His face, cool. it didn't look good, the face. Like, it looked funny as that. Well, it started melting off. It looked really cool. It looked extremely cool. For a minute there, I was like, oh, is this shit real? And I was like, nah, it was just, like, kind of in his head or something like that. And I was just like, dude, yeah. how do you explain to the kids? Uh, sorry, kids. Uh, he kind of had his face melted right off. I, I don't know what happened. I love that. He's like, he's not coming back. No fucking Dude, shit. He got all the shit. He was bitten. You know, you know what? You know, actually, you know what? Fuck that guy. Do you see how much he was making himself at home? Just grabbing things and eating and stuff like the wits, the fucking chips. He goes in. He just. Dude, it's like the guy in the beginning uh, in the in the film where he what literally. Why did he die? He takes a spoonful of the sauce. He goes. And then puts it into the fucking thing. Oh, God. You're going to be an asshole. At least have the decency to not put the spoon what back in. What a fucking monster. A creature. That's probably one of the most horrifying things of this film. That was the most horrifying thing. I hate that. What's, I do not like okay, that. I don't get that. What's with these fucking people making themselves at home so much? Was this in, uh, like during the times that people do this? Back in those times? Oh, dude. And the people were like... Flirting at his daughter. Oh, their daughter. That was just. Oh, oof. dude, that, that was fucking gross. Like, why? She, like, she uh, do you? She's in. I don't even know how old she is, but she looks young, right? She looks very young. Like, fuck off, dudes. That's gross. Oh, you know what? <sighs> Whatever happens to these people, they deserve it. Even that guy there who got bitten, he fucking deserved it, dude. All right. Who the hell goes into somebody else's home, takes their steak? Takes their chicken wings or legs and Ritz crackers and just shoves his hand on the Ritz cracker things. Like it was pretty much his. It was his home at that point. Like no, fuck him, dude. His home, his ghosts. Pretty much. Fuck him. What an ass. I don't know. I actually like the movie, man. I'm just blown away. The finality was like far more than I expected. What about the tree trying to eat the kid? That was crazy, dude. I was like, what? It's like I don't like the tree. <laughs> Holy yeah, fuck. man. Not so. Uh, you know. Dude, I loved that. That was such a. I, that was like one of my favorite parts, man. He's like trying to gobble up the kid and everything. Yeah, the tree. He's like, nom, nom, nom. I was like, dude, I'll never trust trees ever again. Nah, man. If I was that kid, dude. I, dude, he has a lot to be a scared, like a be afraid of now. That's it. He's got a whole lot. Dude, imagine when Lord of the Rings came out. And he saw those Ents. Fuck no. Watched Harry Potter and saw the Whomping Willow. Fuck, Fuck no. no. <laughs> you know. There's a lot of trees that to be afraid of, he's, that's for sure. Traumatized for life, dude, I'm yeah. telling you. Oh I, I don't know, man. He kind of conquered his fear of clowns, though. Yeah, he beat the shit out of that clown, like we were saying before. <laughs> that was probably one of my favorite parts. Like, just tearing him apart. No, you know, the best part of this entire movie was the fucking line from Steven, their father. And it was just like, what am I going to say? Tell him to go to hell? And, and then she was like, and then, I can't remember what you say, say, I can't do that. And then she's, she's like, then what are you going to say? Well, I'm going to give him directions. That was so goddamn good. That was such a well like delivered line. Yeah, that was genuinely funny. I liked it a lot. It was really great. I I like that. Nothing happened to the dog. Like, 
Oh. After the conjuring, dude, that dude. pissed me off a lot. I didn't Tweed's like that. Tweed's dead. Those goldfish are yo, fucking what dead. What the big monster is actually Tweedy, and he's like fucking pissed, dude. He's like, yo, what the fuck? Could you give a, a guy another licorice? Right? Could you give me a bit more? Maybe a whole bag of Twizzlers? What about a bouquet of flowers? You know? Why didn't you give me more shit? Why don't you give me a fucking coffin? I was in a cigar box, for God's sake. You know, they disrespected Tweety. No, maybe it was Tweety. He was enacting revenge. He's like, fuck you guys. He's like, yo, dead people. Want to fuck him up? They're like, yeah. Yo, man, they almost flushed me down a fucking toilet. Let's fuck him up. You know? <laughs> I'd be pissed too. Honestly, if I was that damn bird. Yeah, I, I can relate, man. That's that's just not cool. No, not cool at all. No. I don't know. That's a really good movie. For its time, dude, that thing must have blown so many minds. Yeah, I think that's the beauty of uh, Steven Spielberg, man. He really just, like... he, You know what? He really tries to push the boundaries of, like, holy shit. What the fuck is going on? Holy yeah, shit. Really this is going to, on? Yeah, he tries to push the boundaries of making movies fucking amazing. You know, he really tries his best to go out there and push it's, the limits. It's also amazing how versatile his films are. He never stuck in, in the same path or in the same lane. He no. literally dabbled in a bunch of stuff. And I respect that entirely. I like that. A lot of directors, a lot of them seem to do... Oh, like they this. always just... They stick to, like, a meta or they're to, like, their, to their niche. And, and like... They kind of never break away from it. And it always just feels a little samey. Yes. It's like, for example, even the Coen brothers... Yeah. Even though they have the same concept where shit just gets worse and worse and worse, they always have different stories revolving around it. Yeah, they have different stories to tell. Yeah, it, it's really interesting. They, they're great at what they do, too. I love that. But just in general, good movie. Uh, I'm very happy this one and we watched it. I'm excited. I'm excited for the future and I hope you guys are, too. I think we're going to bounce. Yeah, we're going to kind of... We're going to... Yeah, we're gonna bounce. We're gonna bounce. We're gonna bounce. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna peace on out like the fucking clown. All right? <laughs> yeah, we dead Stupid like Stupid ass clown bitch, Hong Kong, all over the fucking hell, all right? Dumbass clowns, man. I hate them all, dude. Uh, I hate every fucking clown. Fuck My clown. dad's a clown. Fuck him. All right? I don't give a shit. Uh, okay. Um, fuck clowns. I'm not scared of them. I just fucking hate them. Not scared of them, we just hate them. That's it. There's nothing wrong with that. Let a man hate his clowns. <laughs> I have nothing else to say to that. Bye! Give me a fucking clown right now! <laughs> <laughs>